Right, hello, welcome back. Um, just thought I'd have a little look around Louise Westwood. It's been sitting out here, I don't know how long it's been sitting out here for. Um, I know I've done the Christmas video sitting on it. Not last Christmas, Christmas before that was in the workshop then. So I don't know how long it's been sitting out here, quite a while. Um, this has got like other bits and pieces what we've been fiddling with but Lou left it outside basically as much of my fault as it is his spanners left on it they've been out here for ages um, yeah well what's supposed to happen is I had a moan at him yesterday because he's playing Fortnite all the time I said he needs to get his backside down here and uh, and uh, do a bit of work on it and there's still no response. Like I said before, I think I'll end up doing it myself. Probably for myself. I thought doing he's not interested, he's not interested. He took the plate off for the seat to put the the um, hater seat on it. And because uh, it wanted drilling, it was never done. There's all kinds of stuff left on here. I've no idea what's in here, if anything. Nah, nothing. Uh, radio control motor out of me, um, got one of my boats, that's SC solid. <coughs> so we all look under the bonnet. Um, yeah, just how he left it. So we, we sort, of wired, sort of wired it up, um, sort of near enough sort of thing to make it work with a uh, cutout switch which is there um, not an emergency cutout switch we made up then we made um, yeah I think the reason it was moved out is because of the lack of space in the workshop to start with and then I put the MTD in so um, I think it just got left, well, it's a shame um, as you, if you don't know much about it, it's uh, obviously a 230 number, but it's pretty standard uh, apart from the wheels and the well, apart from the tyres. We've got the tyres on it, got 21 inches on the back, I think they are 15s on the front of it. They're standard 15 fronts, but they, these ain't obviously, these are for the mud. <laughs> um, in this case, you're not into the mud mowing sort of stuff, you wouldn't know, but. Um, we might not know. Um, so like I say, so it's got an open diff on it. A standard clutch, which is a twin pulley clutch on these anyway. Um, what else is there to say about it? Not a lot. So we never finished fixing the uh, brake back on. I put a brake on here, I ripped off and I got dragged along there. And I fell off of it. <laughs> got dragged on the track. Um, I like apologise for any wind noise, because it's windy out here. And uh, Milo's whining like he normally does as well. Um, but I think I'm going to start work on it. Like I said, I had a moan at him yesterday because he does play bloody Fortnite. Which is getting on my nerves. And then on half term this week. And he said to me yesterday, well what else can I do apart from go play games? And like I said, get your ass down there and do something with this because he's starting to rot. As you can see in here, I'll move it away. It's starting to rot, and you all know how good this machine was when we first got it. We've never been left outside or nothing, so like I said, a lot of that's my fault as well. I understand that. Um, yeah, so we are on my sport channel, we're supposed to be, so uh, I think that needs to be dragged in. And uh, I'll show you where I'm going to put it, I hope. Right, I hope you can still see. It's getting dark now. I did do this bit, but when I went to um, edit the uh, the bit of film, it, the computer decided to do a, an update because it wiped the sound on it, so... <laughs> uh, that's handy. So it's getting a bit dark now. Um, what the plan is, underneath here is the MTD, hopefully you can see it. Um, the plan is to take that outside 
and put the westward um, where that is for now and then obviously I'm still doing uh, the lift fan I'm trying to stay inside a bit because it's, it's, right, so it's raining so uh, yeah I've got I've done, I've done a few bits I've got to be uploaded yet but uh, I just haven't had a chance to upload them and there's a few bits I've got to do like the uh, brake calipers and stuff or front brake caliper and bits I've still got to film them um, but it's a bit of a pain because I've got like bits of uh, the Murray <laughs> and stuff I move it every time I want to get onto it so that's why I need a good clear out as you can see because <laughs> all the junk's just ended up on top of the uh, damage incorporated machine, the MTD. Um, not sure. Well, I had got plans for that, but I think I might alter the plans for that. I'm not too too sure yet. Um, just I need to build stuff. I don't think we're going to be able to see it. I'll hopefully focus. The generator now. The generator was on the bench. Now mine. She finally got onto me the other day, and we done a deal so I've got that now um, but behind the bench what you can't really see is about uh, I suppose about five foot and that's where I'm building Project Charlene I've got loads of bits on the floor I do my welding behind there as well I try to keep my welding down one end just because of grinding and everything else the mess you know so but what the plan is now is to turn the bench round to the side and then I'll have uh, rooms sort of this sort of direction for uh, another build, probably Sh Charlene, I should imagine. Um, yeah, so I have the idea of to have three projects on the go, so when I run out of parts on one, I can still do stuff on the others. And uh, if I've got something here that will roll rather than this thing with flat tyres. Um, when I get the mower jobs in and that, I can uh, do them there. My host just come in. Be careful with him because um, what he does, he eats everything, and I mean everything. That's why you end up with all this crap out. Um, if you're nothing but trying to eat them batteries or whatever else is. So, come in, Milo, out, mate. Um, the other thing is, I've got my electrics all hanging down at the moment. I'm never very good with it. <laughs> the plan is to. Rewire. So as you can see, the shelves moving. Where he's gone in the shelves. I've got my little bed down there actually, but <laughs> he likes to, he likes to hide behind things. So, uh, Marlo, what are you doing, mate? Yeah. So anyway, that's just a little update. It's a bit different than what the original thing was. What I did, sort of meant to put up, but obviously, oh, so I've lost a bit of film. <laughs> but uh, yeah. And like so, I don't know. No, I didn't mention it. It was on the other bit. The um, hater. I've done a poll on Facebook. Uh, I don't know where you're going to see that. But uh, I've done a poll on Facebook. Um, if to build it into a mud mower, I'll wait till we can get a little motorbike engine for it. Uh, so go and check it out. Go and check out uh, Con Getty Mower Sport on Facebook. If you want to put a little vote in it, you've got a couple more days to go. Come on, Milo, out of there, mate. Right, I'm going in. Let's try and get this loaded. Um, don't think there's anything else to say. I've got to stop saying um as well. Um, thumbs up. <laughs> I've done it again straight away, didn't I? All right. Just give me a thumbs up and all that if you want. Um, share, you know, all the usual sort of stuff. And I shall see you next time. Bye for now.